Welcome back. The 115th Fighter Wing is bidding farewell to its final F-16 fighter jets at Truax Field. The jets are moving out to make way for the new F-35 jets. Today, a private ceremony was held for the F-16. News 3 Now photojournalist Brian Mesmer was there for the final takeoff. Welcome to the 115th Fighter Wing and the send-off ceremony for the F-16. We're here today to celebrate the women and men of the 115th Fighter Wing as we say a final goodbye to the F-16, a venerable aircraft that we've flown here for nearly 30 years, and today is truly bitter and sweet at the same time. I think that's a big part of why we love our airplanes so much. Our beautiful aircraft are the embodiment of what we do to defend our nation. Fly, fight, and win. The sights and sounds, the smell of the jet fuel, all make our hearts race and turn our gazes upward because of the quality of every single member of this organization over the years. Because the culture here reflects a shared mindset that ensures success in whatever mission comes up. Our team flew 73,832 F-16 flights and 116,904.4 hours in the F-16. That's over 4,871 straight days of flying the F-16. Pretty incredible. I challenge the fighter wing to move forward, focused, to continue to share, teach, and expect a culture of excellence in each other. Thank you to the members of the 115th, past and present, and congratulations on all your hard work. Again, that story shot and edited by Brian Mesmer. Officials there say some F-16s from other units will remain at Truex Field temporarily in order to conduct training while the 115th transitions. The first F-35 jets are expected to arrive in spring of next year.